You actually were with us earlier uh, as we met with some scientists who are already gathering data from this hurricane to better predict the next one. To Sean Waugh, research scientist for NOAA's National Severe Storms Laboratory, hurricanes like Florence are a huge opportunity. We've been down here for a couple of days, so we've kind of looked around and have a couple of good spots in mind. Waugh's job today was to launch high-tech weather sensors attached to balloons right into the middle of Florence. Sean Waugh, nice I'm Jeff. You. Good to meet you. We caught up with him at Wilmington Airport, not far from the Carolina coastline, as he prepared for liftoff. Florence hurts a lot of people when it makes landfall here but it potentially helps with the next hurricane. It does. Every bit of data that we collect helps in the future. We got the chance to launch a balloon ourselves. Jeff, I get you to hold that. Yes. First inflation, then. All right, three, two, one. Blast off. So how high is that gonna go? I've had them go as high as 120,000 feet before. What? Balloon expands to the point where it pops. What's the goal in all of this? Looking at you know where the peak winds are, where they occur at the ground and how that relates to damage, how the environment changes as it moves on shore, transitioning from a hurricane all the way down to a tropical depression. It's the whole picture is, is basically what we're after. Watt told us he has studied five hurricanes in real time. The data gathered from each one have helped people prepare for the next one. So again, as Florence does damage now, it also helps in the future in that way.